Welcome to part 22 of Let's Play uh, Civ 2 in HD, the remix. Um, last episode I had Tiffany work on a horseman and I just realized that she's already supporting an offensive unit so we don't want to be building horsemen right about now. So we're going to go ahead and cut back to caravan. And th um, okay, Liang Zan. Let's see. One, two. Come on, Lewis and Clark. Uh oh. Uh, not good. Now I'm going to build another settler. Okay. Now you build a diplomat. See, Ali build a settler. Okay, now we're going to switch over to the Marco Polo's embassy. And now, as you can see, we've got a whole bunch of wonders. No one else has built a wonder yet. And look at all these. Uh, we're going to let them take Hanging Gardens and the Lighthouse, Oracle, and even maybe even Great Wall. Um, we would need the War Academy, Marco Polo's Chapel. All these are important. So we're going to do Marco Polo's next. Now we're going to activate all these caravans that we have in storage here and put them toward finally we have discovered construction uh... if we can build aqueducts and that's important because it allows cities to increase beyond the size of eight and we can build fortresses uh, okay so next we're going to do engineering hit the three million mark i'm thinking once these cities are sevens and eights are done with anything they're building, they're building aqueducts right away. So we're going to go ahead and move it out of the city and back in to help build Wonder. So we just added 50 and we have 150 shields left. So now it's down to 100. So now it's down to 50. So as you can see, those three caravans were three quarters of the way done with Marco Polo's embassy. That's why I wasn't very... Uh, concerned about having to build some other things in between while we load up on the caravans. Okay, so we just finished building the settler. So let's go ahead and uh, put the settler down here. Now the r only reason I'm doing this is a couple reasons. First, almost all the squares over here that the new settler will be using for the city will pretty much all be grasslands. There'll be some arctic regions. That's okay. Once we get engineers, we can convert those to grassland as well. And also, um, building on this square here, we'll be able to uh, send out boats on both sides of the ocean. As you can see, our continent is very... Oh, never mind. Because this ocean is like a lake. So that doesn't even matter. Oh well. Well, that's a, just the best place to put it anyway. You know, once you get fooled, can't get fooled again. Okay, non settler, move on out. You guys move on down. Build a road to the next city site. One. Yeah, let's just irrigate there. Since we're already here, might as well, right? You will move over here. You guys will continue moving. Move here. Yun Jung. Remember, we're going to commit Yun Jung's uh, second unit to guard duty, so we'll leave him on pikemen for now. Fortify. Yeah. Move this here. Um, move these. Uh, this guy's almost in position. One, two. Um, up. Okay. Siunga is already done with the pikemen, so let's release the legion. We'll fortify the pikemen, and we'll build the diplomat. We'll keep moving up. Okay. Down right here, Nangong. You build the second one. keep pushing up. The enemy's right there. This is not the time to, to sit back and uh, pat ourselves on the back for a job well done. 
Not yet, anyway. Liang Zhen. Uh, I'm worried because Liang Zhen is all by himself, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, buy a rush build the rest of the pikemen so he can get some defense out here. Uh, build the road. Yuna built settlers. Got two settlers here. Build a caravan. Okay, let's uh, finish off the rest of the river squares. Yeah, I've got one more, one or two more to go. Let's, oh, hold on. Keep moving. Let's see. Do we want to waste six? Six shield. Yeah, let's just do it. Wasting six shield is not like wasting eighteen. Okay, so we're gonna have Marco Polo's done this turn. Irrigate. One, two. One, two, three. One, two, three. Keep moving. Let's move you toward the river. Try to take that up there. One more square to Soyun. This way, you move this way. Yuna. Let's see, are there any more dimpled? There's one more right there. Let's go ahead and irrigate that one. Just go build a road. You build a road too. Okay, four minutes. I'm gonna skip these guys. And I can't really think about what to do with them yet. So let's just move the other people that we do know what we're gonna do with them. Build a road. One, two, three. Build a road. One, two, one, two, three, just out of range of their city. Move this guy up. Oh, they they want to really push there for another city. And no, we're not going to play that game. One, two. We'll hold them till our diplomats get there. Now I'm going to buy their ass. Push them back. Let's uh, have you build an explorer on this side. Okay. Now we're back to Huna. Okay, let's just uh start keep building roads, Gayun. Let's build a settler. Kiev. Oh. Wow, that's a lot of offensive units. Gion settler. Okay. Build another one. Marco Polo's is done. Yeah, now we get to extort. Let the extortion begin. While we load off on caravans, I'm going to go ahead and switch off the aqueduct. So, and we're ready to build a city up here. This one will be Kara Guri. Kara Guri. There we go. Build that pikeman road. Get on the river. Ah, uh, he could have jumped on the river right there. It's a misstep. Oh well. One, two, three. One, two. Is this irrigated? I don't remember. Yes, it is. Okay. Let's irrigate this forest river. It's about damn time. Um, Road here. Move up toward the city. Move out. And we are almost done with our time for this segment. 
So join us next time, okay?